Hey guys, it's Gigi and Nat. I just finished my makeup and Nat's texted me from downstairs, do you wanna shave my head? So, of course, being the hair expert that I am, having shaved a million heads in my day, I said yes. Just kidding, I've never done this before. The fact that you trust me is amazing. Why five? Are you scared? No. Recently, she dyed it black and it's kind of faded like quite a bit. And this is like a dreadlock. I have a bunch of tools here, hair buzzing trimmers. Oh my god, there's literally hair in here. That's so gross. Do you think I'm supposed to get my hair wet or no? Um, no. I mean, we'll just, I mean, can you even brush through this hair right now? Oh my god, I feel like I'm at first choice hair cutters. We have a $10 special today. Salon Gigi taking appointments. Yes, I promise. She thinks I'm gonna fuck it up on purpose. I would never. Before you glitched all my hair off. <laughs> me. Wait, feel how much this vibrates. I feel like feel familiar? Don't. <laughs> so this is the before. You look like an evil, evil genius. genius. I knew it. I knew it was coming. Well designer. HSN. $30 off. Woo! Do you want to Google it first? Just should you know? No, it's fine. Don't worry. If that shaves, that's the space. I don't know. 10 millimeters, 3 eighths of well, an inch. That seems ridiculous. Let me see. <gasps> Here, let me try a side. Okay, ready? Yeah. Wow. Don't get my ears. Oh, sorry. Um, oh, that's a good. That's a good length. You were here for so long. Hey. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what kind of friend? Look, already. Ew, I hate it. Ew. Oh, it's gonna do it even regardless, right? You just. Press and it goes. Like, is there any artistry to going on here? I was kind of banking on you telling me, but I guess this is not a real hair place, so. Oh, Gigi Salon is about to be open <laughs> right next to Epion. Literally, though, there's a Gigi Salon. Oh my god, can you literally die at this? Head down, ma'am. The little cowlick. Do you have a cowlick, Gigi? Or maybe before my surgery. Mm. Does it feel weird? Yeah. I'm not cowlick. Oh god. Should I answer? Yeah. Um, hello? <laughs> that sweet voice. <laughs> Tip, do you want to try? Uh, um, not particularly. Really? Yeah. But you, you have to. Why? Because we're all in this together. Yeah. Show me what to do. Just pull her. You go like this. You don't have to. We'll just maybe like that. And then, and then like go this. right against it. Yeah. Oh. Isn't that weird? That's so weird, Camden. What? Just one? Yeah. What was your worst? ever hair experience. I feel like they've all been good because I just always get into it, but... I feel like you can pull off anything, but yeah. was there anything you didn't, like, you absolutely would never do again that you hated? Yeah, I guess that I went to... Cornrows? Like, I went to a random barber. They shaved the sides and I had hair at least this long, and they literally only did the sides. It wasn't a mohawk, it wasn't a faux hawk, but silver lining was I had Chris McMillan fix it, and that was the first time he ever cut my hair. I feel like my worst yeah, what was hair. Your, I was just, yeah, what was yours? I know I like wasn't getting asked. I'm like I think my. <laughs> <laughs> So glad you guys asked. Honestly, like the amount that I loved my like side swoop Justin Bieber moment from ages literally like 12 to 17 was cute for a moment, but I'm really happy that that's gone. And like just the amount of time and stress it took up of my whole day. One gust of wind, I would literally have to like go home and like re hairspray it, reset it. But that's because I was insecure about my forehead. <laughs> <laughs> Am I being rough? Uh, yeah, a little. Sorry. Babe. No, but it's it's cool. It reminds me of when you had your hair shaved in Sweden, I think it was, because this is like your natural color. Well, a little bit darker than your natural color. It's, it's just your not her natural hair color. That's adorable. You this don't is think? Awful. Yeah, this is <laughs> crazy. Please get it off of me. Ew. No, this is my worst haircut ever to date. Like, what? No, because of right now. Because you let this. You don't like that? Because you let this. This is, the, this is my like, style. Ew. Oh my god, it's so sad. Oh my gosh. The last piece. Blind faith and like trust in head shaving is honestly a moment, but I kind of like it. But I feel like you can't mess up with these. Like, literally, it's just like keep it on the cute little setting and then you just like kill it. I mean, I feel like there's some insurance. Ah, yeah, but I literally just almost broke my nail. Okay, yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, now I totally understand why they put you in those capes. Mm -hmm. Hair just gets everywhere. everywhere. So what you thought the worst hair time ever was? I want to say like hair metallics or hair tinsels. Like Adrian Maloof, how she got those like little hair tinsels put in. Do you remember from Real Housewives? No, but this feels crazy. <laughs> Your hairline is so good. It's so annoying. Look at it, it like goes down. Goals. Soon. Woo! How do you feel? Excited to see. I feel like that's my whole head of hair. Gross. That literally is like a man's toupee. And you Yucky. can tell where it's like gone really light. <laughs> Should I eat a piece to show how much I love Ew, you? Ew, no, don't. Okay. Show me that you love me by not doing that. <laughs> okay. Is there hair in it? <coughs> yes. Ew. Okay, so we are done with the haircut. Give like a 360. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I love it. Yeah? I feel like you might have gone a little bit. Too short? I don't know. We'll see. No, you Well, it's all the hair. same length. You did great. All right, well, thanks guys for watching this video. My first time shaving a head. And until we see you guys next time, stay gorgeous.